and gentlemen, Rudds here. We're going to do a uh, another shave review tonight, soap review, excuse me. Um, this one's kind of special to me. My buddy Tyler Gaines uh, from the Shave Market sent me a sample of Tim's Greek Peach, which I handy dandy put in this little, um, little Tupperware. A lot of guys that have gotten samples from me are familiar with that. Uh, to lather it, I'm going to use my Mule Ritmo Black Fiber Silver Tip. Uh, black Fiber, excuse me, not Silver Tip. And we'll commence the uh, whisker destruction with this M. Jung number 80. Masterfully redone by my friend uh, Dustin Wade. And to finish off the shave, which hazel obviously, but then we'll do the uh, WSP Rustic Aftershave Sample Barbacool. Very nice, very nice scent. It's a, um, to take on barbershop, really, really nice. Uh, this is thanks to uh, Hugo German. Love this stuff. Probably going to pick some up now that they're off in the full size bottles. Going to load this for a little extra because I, it's in this little Tupperware thing. I want to make sure I give the soap its due in terms of load. Now, this soap has been around quite a while. Um, and it was an exclusive soap, I believe, at one point. Um, now it is available through Shave Revolution that I've seen. Um, and I'm not sure if anybody else is carrying it yet, but... It's one of those legendary soaps that, you know, you're drawn to try. So we'll see how it goes. I did do a test lather last night, just on my hand, came out really thick and creamy. Show you some pictures of that now. Pretty good. So I think we've got enough here. Gonna take what's kind of spilled around, we'll wipe it on. Really smells good, like uh, peach cobbler, basically. A water. Yep, this is going to be a nice lather, same as last night. These soaps are all just so amazing lately. As soon as you get the, uh, you know, the right water content, which isn't hard to do, they just blow up on you. That's good. Gonna wipe off and get going. Super. 
case. Ha! Laugh right in your face. Ha! Get a judge a kiss. Ha! Take my jewels out the fridge. My God, I get religious. When I see my wrist. And ooh, I get so vicious. Cause it's coming to this. My blood bang, I'm change, I'm strange, I'm how could you ate something to caught you from nothing? Make you feel like blood ain't shit. That's something I take to the grip, ain't you? Don't see the real, so stick to the script. And I'm in love with real. To my hood, feel like this. I exist to persist. On my suit, to persist. I talk big to fish, so I quit. So I quit. Fuck no, I made it. Fuck no, I made it. Fuck no, I made it. I'm unestimated till they gotta pay it And then they gon' pay it And I'ma play this And I'ma play this Put it up in the natives Like, like Oh yeah Today I feel Super Bowl Feel it in your mind And you lose control Feel it in your breast And you super soft I don't say it Yet another nice two pass shave. One more day and I'll be able to go over that. That's pretty much healed and it's got some whiskers around it, but I just want to make sure it's totally healed before I start cutting the skin around there. So that was a excellent shave. I did I did get myself a touch right there. So the uh, the Tim's Greek peach is uh, really good cushion. It actually, ironically, lathers up like Greek yogurt thickness. I mean, it's it's really cushiony, and um, it provides it provides good good glide as well. I'd say it's definitely has more cushion. Then it does slickness, but it's still slick enough for me to use on a uh, straight shave, no problem. Which hazel? We'll go for a recap. So, Tim's Greek Peach, available on shave revolution and i don't know where else so if you but if you guys do know where else please uh put it in the comments so folks can uh jump on it if they want to we use the uh, mule black fiber lots of nice lather left here as you can see very peaky good stuff Whisker Destroyer, gorgeous M. Jung, number 80, Dustin Wade re Restore, Witch Hazel, and we'll uh, finish it off here with some of this WSP Barbacool. Oops. Let's not put lather back on the face. Nice little alcohol kick on this one. Really nice scent. Kind of a... Uh, I don't know. It's kind of unique in terms of the barbershop scent. Ooh, and I think there's a little benthol on there. So, that'll do. See you all tomorrow for the TSM update. Have a good evening.